we consider an example from the unit matrices and determinant which has appeared in a joint entrance examination main. The problem has appeared in JEE main exam held on 20th July 2021 in the morning shift. The question is from the unit matrices and determinants. We now state the problem. The problem is let capital A be a 3 by 3 matrix whose first row is 1, minus 1, 0, second row 0, 1, minus 1, third row 0, 0, 1 and capital B the matrix is equal to 7 times A power 20, A multiplied 20 times minus 20 a power 7 a multiplied 7 times plus 2i b is equal to 7 times a power 20 minus 20 into a power 7 plus 2i where i is an identity matrix of order 3. The question is if b is equal to bij then b13 is equal to that is the element in the first row and third column of capital B is to be found. Given A is equal to 1, 3 by 3 matrix whose first row is 1, minus 1, 0, 0, 1, minus 1, second row, third, third row is 0, 0, 1. Then you have to multiply A with A, A square. You have to do it. You have to do it. And the matrix A square is first 3 by 3 matrix, first row 1, minus 2, 1, second row 0, 1, minus 2, 0, 0, 1. A cube is this. In this, you watch this red elements and a blue element. A power 4 is this matrix. Is this matrix. A power 5 is this matrix. A power 6 is this matrix. So if you multiply 6 times, the diagonal entries are 1, 1, 1, 1 only. And this element, 1, 1, 2 element, 1, 2 element, first row, second column element. And second row third column element is one and the same with a minus of the index and these are varying these are varying so now for any n belongs to n we have a power n is equal to 1 1 1 minus n minus n and a t suffix n we do not know what is the t n we have to find the t n where T1 is equal to 0, T1 is 0, T2 is 1, T3 is 3, T4 is 6, T5 is 10, T6 is 15. Then the question is what is Tn? What is the general term Tn? That is the question. A close examination of these things will tell us, will tell us at T3, 3, 3 C2 is 3. At T4, 4 C2 is 6. At T5, 5 C2 is 10. At T6, 6 C2 is 15. That means uh, T suffix N will be N C2. But unfortunately, this n c2 doesn't make sense when n is equal to 0, when n is equal to 1. When n is equal to, when n is equal to 1, 
1c2 has no meaning of course nc2 2c2 it works so it doesn't work for this for, for this so a close examination reveals that t suffix n is equal to nc2 it works from from here n is equal to 2 onwards but n is equal to 1 it doesn't work it doesn't work but however nc2 means n into n minus 1 by 2 tn is equal to n into n minus 1 by 2 if you take it will work even for one and works for all others all others therefore we a close examination reveals that t suffix n tn is equal to n into n minus 1 by 2 that uh, nc2 is taken out now at the end i will tell you how the formula for tn can be obtained systematically but let us proceed now for any n belongs to n we have a power n is equal to 3 by 3 matrix first row 1 minus n t n second row 0 1 minus n third row 0 0 1 where t suffix n is n into n minus 1 by 2 now b is equal to b i j 3 by 3 matrix is equal to 7 times a power 20 minus 20 times a power 7 plus 2 times i so that will be equal to 7 into a power 20 a power 20 will be the 3 by 3 matrix first row 1 minus 20 t 20 second row 0 1 minus 20 third row 0 0 1 minus 20 times yes a power 7 a power 7 is 1 minus 7 t 7 0 1 minus 7 0 0 1 plus 2 identity 2 into 1 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 1 now you have to multiply and write it as a single matrix what i will write is i will not write all these things but i am i will write only the what the term i am going to get at this position that is first first row third position of b b13 position i will write this is equal to is all blah, blah 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 and at b13 position 7 times t20 minus 20 times t7 plus 2 times 0 is 0 so b13 is 7 into t20 minus 20 into t7 therefore b13 is equal to 7 into t20 minus 20 into t7 we know the formula tn is n tn is equal to n into n minus 1 by 2 so that will be equal to 7 into t20 t20 will be 20 into 20 minus 1 by 2 minus 20 into t7 7 into 7 minus 1 by 2 so that will be equal to simplify 7 into 20 by 2 is 10 into 20 minus 1 is 19 minus 20 uh, 20 by 2 is 10 into 7 into 6 so that will be equal to the first one is uh, 7 into 10 into 19 is 1330 minus 10 into 7 into 6 is will be minus 420 that will be equal to 910 so therefore your answer is b13 is 910 the the discussion of the problem is now over the answer is b13 is equal to 910 but the question is how do we get the formula for t suffix n tn tn how do we find so that i will do in the last slide for all practical reasons the problem is over how to find t suffix n tn we have t1 is 0, t2 is 1, t3 is 3, t4 is 6, t5 is 10, t6 is 15, 
is a sequence of natural numbers then what is its nth term so the problem is on sequences so t suffix n is equal to n into n minus 1 by 2 we will prove tn is equal to n into n minus 1 by 2 so what do we do first first i'll put a tabular form this is the tabular form t1 t2 t3 t4 t5 t6 etc tn n nth term and t1 is 0 1 3 6 10 15 tn is tn i don't know so what i will do is i will write t1 under t2 t2 under 3 t3 t3 under t4 t5 t4 under t5 t5 under t6 etc tn minus 1 under tn so i will write these are the things so one position moved and minus you subtract them subtract 0 this will be 0 this will be 1 this will be 3 minus 1 2 6 minus 3 3 10 minus 6 4 15 minus 10 5 and 6 etc at the end tn my tn minus tn minus 1 so i will get these things 1 2 3 4 5 6 n minus 1 so what do you observe t2 minus t1 is 1 t3 minus t2 is 2 t4 minus t3 is 3 so what will be ti minus ti minus 1 that will be equal to i minus 1. That is tn minus tn minus 1 will be n minus 1. Notice that ti minus t suffix i minus 1 is equal to i minus 1. This is true from 2 onwards. i is equal to 2, 3, 4 up to n. So now individually you write and sum it up. Sum it up. So now sigma i is equal to 2 to n of ti minus ti minus 1 is equal to sigma i is equal to 2 to n i minus 1. So, write this one, write this one. The first term will be t2 minus t1 plus t3 minus t2 plus t4 minus t3 plus t5 minus t4 plus at the end for i is equal to n tn minus tn minus 1 that is equal to that is equal to i is equal to 2 means 2 minus 1 1 onwards so that will be equal to 1 plus 2 plus 3 at the end n n will be n minus 1 n minus 1 so this is the the red one so it will be the sum of the first n minus 1 natural numbers now what you observe here is what you observe is this t2 cancels with this t2 and this t3 cancels with this t3 this t4 cancels with this t4 this tn minus 1 cancels with a term before it and you are left with practically tn minus t1 this is called telescoping this is called telescoping this implies this implies tn minus t1 and this is 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus etc n minus 1 is the sum of the first n minus 1 natural numbers the formula is the for the sum of the first n natural numbers is n into n n plus 1 by 2 so here n is n minus 1 n minus 1 into n minus 1 plus 1 by 2 that is n into n minus 1 by 2 and t1 is 0 t1 is 0 this implies tn is equal to n into n minus 1 by 2 so thus the formula for tn can be formed and uh, this completes the discussion on the problem i hope that you have understood the problem and its solution and work out some more problems on these lines from a standard textbook. All the best.